what is going on? Two amateurs, disc reviews. We got amateur one, amateur two, or amateur one and amateur two. That's up to you to decide. And today we're going with the Discraft Cicada. Um, no one here has thrown this one yet. I don't, nope. At least I don't think. Nope. I don't even have one yet. And the numbers are, is it 7611? 7611. Stable, a lot of glide. We'll mm -hmm. see what happens. Should be straight. Should be fun. Let's go. All right. Discraft Cicada. 170, 172. Actually says 172.5. Z-line plastic. I bag a few Z-line plastic. I do like it. Um, let's see what I can do with it. Not bad. That one's got a lot of glide on it. So I like that aspect. Mm -hmm. And Chris? Let's see what we can do with this one. Oh, that's a good throw. There we go. I'm happy with that. Yeah, he parked it. I'm happy. He parked it. <laughs> All right. And Jason with his second throw. Not bad. Not bad. And Chris is second throw with the cicada. Three. <laughs> okay, guys. Okay, guys. Final reviews for the Discraft Cicada. Who wants to go first? I like it. Um... Wish I had done this disc first instead of last. My arm got very tired. Didn't get good throws on it, but I mean, it flies good. Does like a lot of, I've noticed a lot of stable disc craft discs do. They don't really hold straight, at least for me. I know bigger arms can probably throw them straight on a straighter line and stay there. But uh, this deal dumps off a little bit to the right for me, left for right-handed players. But I do like it. Um, again, Z-Line plastic. I'd like to see what this will throw like with the uh, ESP plastic when they make it. So, mm -hmm. good little... Uh, Probably a good beginner driver with that much uh, with that much glide, just a seven speed. Probably be really good for a beginner to bag that. Just probably their primary driver for a little while. Mm -hmm. Chris, uh, truth through well for me. I uh, I you know it kind of fits in there where my Maverick does from. So overall, I'd say yes, absolutely. Because uh, as you know, I carry my Maverick all the time in my bag so i would say absolutely someone who's beginning this would be an excellent excellent addition to their bag all right my thoughts on it is is twofold one great beginner disc i think it's a very good beginner beginner disc uh two i think it's uh again for the beginner arm i do think it's slightly more overstable than that the numbers on it that negative one one i think it may be maybe a negative one two Maybe because it does have that dump right at the very end. Again, for the slower arms. Uh, my friend Zach, he throws about 450-ish on his drives. He threw one I saw the other day. It stayed pretty straight almost the entire way, but at the end, it still had that little dump at the end. So I like it. Uh, again, beginner disc, heck yeah, definitely, definitely. Um, so I recommend this disc. <clears throat> when I saw it coming, I was like, I think this is a disc I'm going to like. So I'm looking forward to being able to throw it. Uh, anything else, guys? You guys have an incredible day.